we were inside this morning doing our morning ritual stuff and we were we were a big old group of turkeys <laughs> i'm gonna google it uh, i'm gonna learn something maybe if you don't know it or you know it you can tell us i'm gonna call it a flock like birds birds are flocks right yeah except a group of crows i know is called a murder i and a group of geese is called a gaggle <laughs> I'm so what's sure. a group of so it's a group of turkeys <laughs> What's it called? Tell what, us. Yes, put in the comments down there. Even if you have to Google it, please tell us because I <laughs> don't know why we know as much as we know, to be honest. Flock, <laughs> gaggle, murder. Is murder is crows, you uh -huh. said? Oh, that's More weird. than two crows is called a murder, which is kind of creepy. <laughs> Probably why they got a bad rap. <laughs> we're going to get the tools set up and then we're going to get some trim on the windows. Yeah. Shouldn't be too so. bad of a project. Something easy to do, but it needs to be done. Yep. Whew. All right, we're gonna set up over here. Can't really get out of the wind, so we might as well be in the sunshine, right?
Yeah. <laughs> of an inch too much. You only have after this window. You only have one more to frame because you'll have the one up in the loft. That's true. It's good encouragement. <laughs> I try to find the positive, guys. <laughs> Trim is not his favorite, so he only has to do one more window after this one. Your supervisor. I a sleeping puppy. Third time's the charm. DIY, that'll do. <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. Alright, guys. Now that we have the interior framing of the window in, we need to go find from our pile of trim something that we're happy with. You guys should, if you're new here, go back and watch some of our old videos because we have a lot of cool little adventures and little things that led up to this cabin. Now, you might see this cabin think oh that's beautiful or oh that looks like a hack job i don't know what kind of person you are uh even though we love our cabin and it's beautiful we did everything on a budget so we have a lot of cool videos over the last couple years uh that we went and found great deals and that made this cabin possible for us right mm -hmm. i'll show you just real super quick the windows that we did before last winter not this past winter but a year ago this last winter Ew. yeah it was a long time ago so we framed the windows out just like we did in there. And then we have all this nice, beautiful, little more fancy trim, right? Like it's, it's hard to tell. Like, here you go. Like different colors. It's aged. Most of the window trim in here is all the same, but it's, some of it might be a little different, but... I bought two truckloads of uh, trim for a hundred bucks a piece or less, so I have less than two hundred dollars into trimming the entire cabin. Which is awesome because trim is so expensive. Each piece of trim is like ten, fifteen bucks minimum. If yeah. it's not even nice stuff, it's just normal stuff. So it's we make it work. And I and like it. Fits, it. Our, fits our cabin vibe. Yeah, like we, our rustic cabin vibe. We're yeah. not going for perfection. We're not going for chic or fancy. Fancy. We're going for rustic, cozy. And this actually just gives it like a little bit of a extra flair is not the right word, but just gives it a little extra touch without big expense. So like I said, it's hard to show you because of the glare of the window. But nice trim. I mean this trim's probably twenty five bucks to thirty bucks. This is expensive stuff. Like this stuff in the kitchen is a little bit different than the rest of the cabin, but we don't care. Looks well, close enough I mean, to the same, and yeah, it's got the same, pretty much the same width as all we were kind of going for. And uh, yeah, it's like sat in someone's garage or barn. It's got a little bit of staining to it and aging. So, so a couple people closed down their little wood shops or cabinet shops, and I picked up all this stuff for real cheap, and we're pretty excited about it. Yep. So. Check out some of our older videos of the kitchen build a couple winters ago. Don't let those videos go to waste just because they're a couple years old. It doesn't mean they all are terrible. So <laughs> so let's go find some trim at our pile that we have left. Sounds good. All right, guys. So here's a pile of trim. This is bigger stuff. We don't have a ton of this. This is more like baseboard stuff. We got some random littler stuff we have all this here just piles of it a bunch of quarter stuff. round there yeah that's like crown molding kind of so i don't think we Where can do you use put that. that at i was gonna try to use that for like at the tops of the walls all the way around the perimeter of the cabin and then up at the peak 
because okay. it won't be as noticeable like this is a weird angle it's not like a 90 degree angle you know so we're gonna dig through this and we'll see what we could find What do you want me to find? Here, pull, pull these out and take them out. Pull them and get them out of the way as I break them out. <laughs> Such a corn dog. What would you have grabbed? Something not as good as this, and I would have thought it was better. This turned out to be pretty good. Yeah, because I'm one day. Maybe Put once I turn here, so once I turn 40, you'll realize how awesome I am. Maybe. One more day. No, two more days. Oh, tomorrow is one more day. And then it's your birthday. Maybe one day you'll realize just how cool and how awesome I am. How brilliant I am. Okay, so like Jason was talking about inside, a little bit of water stain, weather stain, but aging, and we like it. Some people might not like it, but we do. It works good for our cabin vibe. It's just got different colors. Pretty, so this evens it out a little bit. All right, well there you go. So, but we like it, and we like it because the price, because it's way cheaper. Hopefully we have enough. gonna oh, butt no, up to not. it right no it's fine do you have enough pieces do you think to do all this or i you have, have enough to... to do this one window so okay. that's what i'm gonna try to not use any more than i have to okay all right perfect perfect Put a few nails in them. Okay. Do I, more after. That way, if I have to take it off, we can get it off. That's a 45 degree angle. So now I just have to measure, like I said, in reality, I just have to measure from here to here. Or in theory. <laughs> what? <laughs> Scout? <laughs> Supervisors are here. Are we doing a good job, Timber? Hmm? It's such a good puppy, huh? Look <laughs> how pretty that looks up there in the corner. Okay. Know what you're doing? I have some idea what I'm doing. <laughs> they don't. <laughs> Excuse me, Dad. You are in my way. If you could please don't step on me when you step backwards. <laughs> you hand me the 
Yep. Brad nailed him. Uh-huh. Looks straight too. Like it's not even like warped. There we go. Look at that. I think these dogs need to go run around outside for a, a few walk. minutes. Yeah. And go wrestle for a little bit. Yes. Afternoon zoomies. Yes, they got. <laughs> what? What are you doing? Goofy dogs. Do you guys need to go take a doggy walk? Go outside and play for a few minutes. Huh? You guys need a break? Huh? Anyone else's dogs like that? Need break time? <laughs> Look, guys. Look at all this beautiful syrup. Two and a quart. Two and a quarter gallons. They were all popping earlier, so we got all that too. We'll have lots of syrup for sale for y'all. Yeah, look at that. Mmm. It's already settling down to the bottom, so that's good. Mm. It's gonna take a while longer. Look at that. Half gallon of beauty. Put it up to the light. This stuff has some nice color to it, man. Got show you the first batch. Hey, this stuff's what? A week old? Look mm -hmm. at the difference in the color. First batch. Second batch. Third batch, but this hasn't settled yet. Mm-hmm. So this will be similar to this color of the second batch. French toast. You pretty much want to eat French toast and your pancakes every day now. All right. Jen's walking the dogs around the yard and letting them wrestle. I'm working because I don't want to be working till 8 o'clock at night. That's what happens. When we do something every 20 minutes, we get distracted with something every 15 minutes. Alright guys, three down, one to go. And the other window if we got enough. That's the kind of stuff that happens. Just go out. I don't know what's wrong with our dogs today. <laughs> Dad, why did you put the tripod right on my bed? Why are you looking at me like that? Huh? <gasps> Alright guys, we got three sides out of four done. I'm going to make the last one. Hopefully I can make it fit nice. Doing good. We'll work on the other Getting one. Getting better at this fancy stuff. It looks really nice. Like, I'm happy with it. Not perfect, but it looks nice. It looks nice. See if I can get super lucky. See, this is a different piece. This is, like, not as thick. Alright, guys. So, I got the corner perfect, but look at this. This is thinner. It's the same exact molding. It's just like a eighth of an inch thinner. And it's not my work. So I gotta go cut another one now. All right, so I got screwed using different trim. It's the same trim, same design is just a little bit thinner it's like a quarter inch thicker uh, all right i'm back guys i just had one more big thick piece
All right, guys, didn't turn out too bad. Oh, look, look who's back. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And teachers. Uh, what do you think about teachers? What? Those are some pretty birds, guys. Pretty birds. Oh, my goodness. There's a ton of toms. All your teachers. All right, guys, so pretty cool to have turkeys up here. Like I said, it's probably 30 of them. So I'm going to do this other window behind you in front of me. Uh, but I'm going to have to find some different trim now because that trim is not all the same width. And I goofed up. I didn't goof up on a piece. I didn't realize it was a quarter inch an eighth inch thinner than the big stuff so